Been there a while. A bit more. <laughs> That's the end, the ball cock goes on. That just simply screws on. I'm not sure which side it goes on yet, so that's just to show you how to screw it on. As you can see, you've got two directions it can go on. Now, we've got a pin here, so this one. Simply connect onto there, put the pin through there, like so, like so, okay. So this is an adjustable nut or bolt, which we'll have to adjust afterwards for the flush. This simply goes on. It goes on to there. Push down. Like so. Or the other way. Whichever way you want water to go. Adjust that to whatever level of water you want in your system. Adjust it to that for now. So when that bolt hits hits that, it will stop the water coming through. The next step now is attach this to the water system. Tighten it too tight just yet. Remember, you need to roll cock on. Now 
and we can see why we've got two threads on there. I'm going to simply screw this ball cock onto this lever I'm on this near side. Tighten up, tighten up this nut. Make sure that's free from there. The ball can move up and down. We might need to adjust that a bit further now. So we're going to have the water higher up. I don't, I don't need that just yet. I'm going to tighten this up. locking up tight make sure that it's moving freely and not catching the side that's it that's nice and tight now to turn the water on and adjust the ball cock At least the noise gone anyway. Now, before tightening the locking us, that looks for right. That looks for right. I'm tightening the locking us up a bit. and noise has gone and these parts we didn't even need I'll keep them for future
Let's put the line. Okay, okay. 